Hi, welcome back to the back 40. It's Mama Juju and we're crafting on the back 40. Well, chickadees, this is what I was talking about in my previous video. I've done it. I went on, faced my fears, and decided to go on and start. And then I thought, okay, well, I'll start the first of the new year and we'll, we'll start week one. And I thought, no, better just go on and just face it and start it. So I have started the Margaret Miller uh, weekly collage challenge thing that everybody's doing. when I just jumped on the bandwagon. And y'all know I have, oh, 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 oh. I have um, <clears throat> issues when it comes to master boards and collages and clusters and all that. It just gives me anxiety because I don't think I do really well with it. And um, so, what's the best thing to do? Just jump in there, practice, do it. Um, I've been watching some of her videos, and I'll put the beginner's link down um, in the uh, description. And I'll also put uh, the uh, weekly challenge explanation prompt down in the description. Um, <coughs> excuse me. What uh, I did was for Kim's weekly challenge for this this week um, in the uh, boho section, I um, print print out her printables, which was um, the butterflies here and here and the butterflies here and the daisies, blue daisies, the background for the boho artism group. Um, the uh, lady and the little girl flying the butterfly and the clock came off of a printable by um, Art Palette. Artist, uh, Artist Palette. Um, it came off a printable I don't even know where I got the printable from, but it is gorgeous. I've got to go to their site. Uh, this is what the printable looked like. I don't know if somebody sent it to me um, or what, but it is gorgeous. It's all blue. And it's called Out of the Blue. Um, and there's the website. It's got a glare on it. You can see it. Um, but it is uh, really there without the glare. There's the, the website. Um, <clears throat> it is, I really like it. I'm going to go see what else they got. Um, but anyway, I used some of that to go. I found that when I was organized and cleaned up this weekend. Um, so I went in and all I did was just took her printable and, um, of course, you know, I like to tear. So I tore it all up and inked it and put it down. And then um, I put these little images over for the focal point. And then on the side here, I just have some white and gold lace and some yellow lace and then some sheer um, blue trim. At the bottom, I had to add my pink. So at the bottom, I just put like a little pink lace there and then the bling with the gold and blue uh, buttons. And then down this side, I just put the... Uh, little clear rhinestones there. So that's the cover. And then on the inside here I made a pocket um, here to put our challenges in. I went, I went on to uh, Miss Miller's site and printed these off. Um, got them and printed those off. And then um, this is a master board that I did with just different stuff here. And um, can you see all that? So I cut the uh, the master board um, off. And, and uh, no matter what I do, you can't mess that glare. So um, I put the master board on here. Then I put the butterfly. Um, I think the Dollar Tree maybe. I don't know. I like it because it does that. It makes a little noise and flops around like it's. You know, trying to fly off the page, and then this is a little cluster, the little square cluster, one inch cluster thing that I made there, and then this one is my Planner Girl pocket. You know, little Target clear pockets that you get. Um, <clears throat> I stuck that in there so we could keep up with these, because you know I'm bound to lose some stuff. 
and then I put a uh, paper clip on them so I can just slide the paper clip over here and try to keep it all safe. Okay. This week's challenge, and I thought, Lord have mercy. Look, Lefty trying to jump out there, y'all. He wants to say hey. Say hey, Lefty. Um, this week's challenge was, um, <clears throat> I thought, goodness gracious. Woohoo. What time to jump in and try to do something? Okay, it is hashtag 2023 CWP 43. Okay. And I don't know if you can see this or not, but this week's challenges, that's got a glare no matter what I do. It's dark. It's, I'm having to record late at night, so it's, it's really dark. Um, stitching, real, drawn, or stamped. The next one is something with fins, F-I-N-S. The next one is a bit of green. The next one is a dessert item. The next one is communication, such as a radio or telephone. The next is the bonus, and it's an office supply. So, okay, y'all read this, and I said, okay, well, I, there's some pretty fishes, some little fishes that I saw, real pretty ones, real pretty ones right here. Um, that was in one a magazine. I don't even know what magazine it was. It was in a magazine, and I thought, oh, those are pretty. I want to... Uh, I want to. I want to use those. Those are real, real gorgeous. So, and then I thought, okay, now how am I going to make something with the fin, a bit of green, and a desert item? Not dessert, desert. My brain read desert. So I was like, how, I sat there and sat there and contemplating. Chris was like, what? What's wrong? And I was like, how am I going to make fish and desert go together? And I thought maybe sand. And he was like, what? So I started reading off to him, and I said, dessert. And he said, that's dessert. You said dessert. <laughs> okay, so it was funny when it happened. It's not funny now. I just wasted so 15 seconds of your life. Okay, anyway, so after I got over that shock, uh, I started collecting things. And this is what I came up with. And it kind of doesn't go, but it kind of does. But, you know, it would be okay. I'll add to it later. Um... I had to go back and read some prompts and stuff again. So this is the wa just a water water colored uh, paper scrapbook thing that you can buy. Um, it doesn't have it on there. I covered it up, but I think I got it at either Walmart or Amazon. One of those two. But I really like it. I don't even know what brand it is now. But I really like it because you can tear the pages out and put them back in like a happy plan. So I like that. Okay, so we're going to set this aside. What I did was, <clears throat> I thought, okay, office supply. Let's just let's just tick these off and let's just tick them off and go. So on the um, stitching, I thought, oh, I got my, my, machine, my new machine. I'm going to stitch. So I did the stitching. I don't know if you can see that or not. But it is um, little flower-like stitching, leaf-like stitching, all the way down and then across here. Okay? So I did that. All right. Then it says something with fins. Of course, you know, I told you. First thing I thought about, I wanted my little fish. So I've got my little fish here. Cut them out. Fussy cut them out of the, the thing. And then a little bit of green. So I had a farm, country farming magazine from 1970. Um... And it had a page on it, and it was this little green, and it showed you how to line out your garden. And I thought, well, that looks like seaweed, so we'll stick this down. The fish can come out of the seaweed, so that's, you know, got them grounded some kind of way. All right, and then the next one was a, a dessert item. So I dug into my, half, my little planter stickers, and I found this uh, piece of cake. So I thought, okay, it's a piece of cake. It's going to be a piece of cake. And um, if you can see that, I'm turning all that there. Got the piece of cake. And the next one was a communication or radio telephone. And I just love these this these antique type telephones. So I thought I got to have that. It would just make me feel better. So I got that one. And the bonus was an office supply. So I laid this down. I thought, oh my lord. That's all that is on the big old page. 
this before I watch the video that shows you that you do you do your prompts plus pattern paper plus embellishments. Okay. So anyway, um, I thought okay. So my office supply said I'll use it. My office supply was a ledger paper. I put it down, cover up the white. That made it look a little bit better. But then I just couldn't figure it out. Then I I went and watched a video and I thought okay, um, I could put some pattern paper down. Well, y'all know I did that cleaning out and stuff and de-stashing and organizing and everything. Well, I don't have much pattern, actual pattern type kind of paper left. So, um, I found this paper. And I thought, okay, leaves. That, that's, that's can go in. You know, we're going to put these leaves down. And I fussy cutted them like that. And I thought, okay, we're going to put the leaves down like this. Um, and then here I am up here working. And uh, we're covering that up. So my office supply item, I thought, okay, I need a, a, a memorandum because that's going to go with the telephone. Because, you know, people call, you take a note, a memo, and give it to whoever you ask the telephone for. And then I thought down here, I'm going to add a little bit of water. So what I fussy cut, I just stuck down here for the water. Because, you know, sometimes the... Well, back here on the back 40, you know, you go to the lake and, or a little pond and the leaves all falling around and stuff now and they get all on it. So, I thought we'd put our little fishies jumping out like this. We'll get one trying to go in the water and one coming out the water. Okay, we done caught them. They lay on the side of the bank trying to get back in the water. And then this... It's a piece of cake, and I thought we'll just stick it right there because, by God, this is a piece of cake. And that's going to be my collage for today. What I'm going to do is just ink it and glue it down. So, Mama Juju thanks you. You can hang around and watch me ink and glue it down, or you can just carry on. Don't forget to like and subscribe and come back and see me again because you never know what's going to happen on the back 40. Bye. <clears throat> so, I'm going to go back. If you're still hanging with me, love you. Okay, I'm going to go back to Miss Miller's site. I'll put that down below too. But I'm going to go back to her site and do some more um, watching of her videos. Because she's got a playlist uh, for the collaging and stuff. And collage art, especially like for beginners and um, I've been watching it and taking notes and stuff because uh, I need some help with this collage business. At least to feel better about it. So, um, that's one of the things I want to go and do. And if I learn something or hear something that just resonates with me, I'll be sure to make a note and holler at y'all about it the next time I come on and do a video. Uh, but go on over there to the site, especially if, you know, you need like me and or just you ain't got to be new a lot of people have trouble with the uh, collaging and master boarding and stuff so uh don't think just because you need that's why you're having trouble it's, it's, it can be an issue for a lot of people so um if you want to go on over there and uh tell her i sent you and said hey and uh subscribe and watch her videos and see if it can kind of help you feel a little better about this situation because um, it can be intimidating. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it don't intimidate you. But it intimidates a lot of me. So, I can look at something and they're like, Oh my God, that, that looks so pretty. I should be able to do that. Then I tried it and I thought, This is the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I have just wasted some time in my life that we won't be getting back. And then somebody else will come along and they'll do it and... Oh, uh, they'll look at what I did and go, oh my God, that's so cute. I like that. That's pretty. You did such a good job. And I'm thinking, why are you BSing me trying to make me feel better? Because this is <laughs> not pretty. Um, but, you know, we are our own worst critics, I guess. And our own worst enemies at the same time. But, um, I just, it's, it's a learning curve. It is a learning curve. Now, I can, uh, I feel okay doing collages and stuff with, uh, happy planning and stickers and making a scene and all that. And I, I guess it's not that much difference. Um, 
in the situation, but for some reason or another, with this junk journaling and putting this stuff out in that blank piece of paper staring at me, it's like, just gives me anxiety. That's the girls. I haven't been able to go on to the chat. I'm going to put this down here. This water down here. Oh. This one here says, you ain't eating me today on a Monday. I'm going back. I'm going to put him up a little higher. He's going back to the water. And this was rough situation for us all. And we need a piece of cake. Some comfort food. Put it right there in the middle. We all need some cake. Flip it all over and cut this off. Okay, there we go. There we have it. Now I'm going to take um, this here for today. I'm going to put today's date on here. I've got a pen up here. I'm going to put today's date on the back. And then I'm going to stick it. Right behind that cake. A little tuck spot. There we go. Uh oh. Sorry. There we go. There you have it. That's our collage page for today. Our very, very first one. Yay. Okay. Thank you for hanging with me. Mwah, mwah. Big hugs and loves. Bye.